Hello, thank you for returning. In the previous video, we solved a problem to calculate the empirical and molecular formula of a compound. We had another problem that I wanted to start and let's do it in this video now. You have to calculate the molecular formula of an iron oxide with mass percentage of iron 69.9% and oxygen is 30.1%. As I told you in the previous video, we'll follow the steps. The first step is to convert these percentages into grams. So iron is 69.9%. So iron would be written as 69.9 grams. Oxygen is 30.1%. So this would become 30.1 gram. Once you get the masses of both the elements or whatever the components are, uh, the elements in grams, we now find out their number of moles. In order to calculate the number of moles, we should write the mass of the element divided by its atomic mass in grams. So iron would be equal to 69.9 is the mass given in grams and what is the atomic mass of iron is 56 grams. And oxygen on the other hand would be how much 30.1 grams divided by 16 so what are the values that you get the values you get on finding out these ratios is 1.248 and the value of oxygen is 1.881 in order to find out the minimum ratio between the two elements now we divide these two by the same value which is the smaller one. 1.2 is smaller than 1.8 therefore both these are divided by 1.248 and this is also divided by 1.248. When you do this you get this as 1 and this as 1.5. Now empirical formula is the formula which is what we had to do was we had to find out the minimum ratio but the minimum ratio should have been a whole number ratio because empirical formula is the formula of the compound in which all the elements are written in their minimum ratio minimum whole number ratios so in order to find the minimum whole number ratio we have to multiply both of these by two so that is what we do we multiply now both of them by two so now we get Iron is 2 and oxygen is 3. So our empirical formula would be iron is 2, oxygen is 3. Right? So you have to calculate N. In order to calculate N, you should have the molecular mass. The molecular mass is given to us is 160. So this is 160 and you have to divide it by the empirical formula mass. The empirical formula is Fe2O3, so let's calculate its mass. Fe is, what's the mass of iron? 56. 56 into 2 plus oxygen is 16 into 3. This would also come to be equal to 160, which means empirical formula mass and molecular mass are the same. If they are the same, the answer, the value of N is 1. If N is 1, we have to multiply the empirical formula by the value of N. Since N is 1, the molecular formula and the empirical formula for this compound are the same. You get me? So what is the molecular formula then? The molecular formula would be Fe2O3. So that's how we solve the problems. That is how we calculate the empirical formula and the molecular formula from the mass percentages of an element given to us. Thank you for watching. See ya.